Hey Capricorns, it's Sunny, and this is your weekly horoscope for the week of March 2nd, 2015. Oh my gosh, March, that means spring is almost here. Hallelujah, hallelujah, because I hate winter. So yeah, but <laughs> all my visions. Um, I saw a cup, and I saw someone with their hand held out, and I saw a little ball in their hand. So that's very, very interesting. And I have a lot of cards for you guys. And also, I'm using two additional cards from my Hobbit deck. So, yeah. But for this week, I feel like there may be... Like, if you are involved with someone and they're really rocky, you're going to be really overwhelmed with them. And you really don't know how to take them. And it's going to get frustrating but honestly, if you feel like this person is worth it, just, you know, wait for them. Like, you really have to ask yourself, is this person worth waiting on? And if you feel in your heart they are not, then, you know, just keep it moving. And it may hurt, but I mean, you got to do what's best for you. But, um, yeah, whoever this potential lover may be, they may be really detached and they may give, give off the vibe that they don't want a relationship and then one minute they're all into you and stuff like that. That's really going to get annoying. And, um, yeah, you're really just not going to know how to take it. So, just, I feel like you just need to move away from them. You know, and like, if you do feel like they are worth it, just give them some space, do your own thing, you know, mingle if you want to because i do see some admirers heading our way however these admirers will just be fuck buddies <laughs> for real you know if you're lucky you will find a good one out the batch but i feel like it's just going to be a lot of horny doggies i do but i feel like this week either you're going to get some good blessings or some bad blessings karma is really going to hit a lot of zodiac signs this month um yeah so just be careful with this oh yeah i saw a spirit and i was like oh no yeah my spirit just told me uh-huh you're right so <laughs> yeah it's really up to you you know if you've been good and if you've been treating people good and you've been treating yourself good then you will get good blessings and if it's the opposite then you know i will pray for you but i feel like we will work hard to beautify our home and also, I feel like we may be kind of hard on our children if you do have kids. And um, it's like you just want to push them to be better. But just be careful. Like, don't push them too much. Um, yeah. So, also, I feel like when it comes to our home front and our finances, we may be kind of fearful about that. And um, we may think too much into our head. Also, trust your intuition when it comes to your finances. Some people may be using you. And... Some of you could be making more, you know? So please be careful with this. Be really cautious and really um, look into your finances. I feel like we will gain some opportunities. Um, Business-wise, this could be, you know, if you if you have your own business, you could um, get an email or a letter of someone wanting to partner up with you. Just be careful of any new business opportunities heading your way. Um, yeah, because I feel like... If you can find out their zodiac sign, I know it's going to be weird. People of the earth sign, you know, which is Cancers, and not Cancers, Capricorns, Taurus, and Virgos. Be cautious around these people. Trust your intuition with that, okay? But um, for the extra cards, I got the Hermit and the Three of Cups. Oh, and this is really cool. With this card, this talks about you are entering a new level of your intuition. And you're being aware of nature and what's going on around you. You may feel at peace. However, some of you may be um, really like all over the place in your mind because you're getting all these ideas and you're getting all these weird feelings and some of you may not really know how to take that um you may feel like a lot of electric shock so yeah you will get a lot of people shocking you and like any random thing you touch you're going to feel electric shocks with that um also this talks about um business deals and like partnerships so that ties in with the um investments and stuff like that so really be careful with this trust your intuition and um be really strong-minded 
because I feel like with this card this talks about some good blessings only if you trust your intuition and with this this talks about past friends coming back into your life and you you know gaining new friends as well so yeah the past past people may come back to you so just be careful with this I feel like this may be a test especially like if this is past lovers or anything like that yeah be careful with this and I feel like this you may think too much when the past decides to come back and knock on your door so yeah be careful if you want to go back and take a few steps back into your past life if you want to move forward let the past stay where it is but try to have a good week this week all my Capricorns and I will see you guys hopefully next week I don't know Bye.